Hey guys, if you have trouble, like if you have this native uh, sidekick and you have trouble getting it out, today I'm going to give you a tip to try to keep you from having to do all this. That's a pain. Coming up. If you have this native sidekick or even the uh, I think it's the groovy landing gear um, that's by boondocks um, I don't know about that one because I don't have that one but I'm sure this would work on it too but for this uh, native sidekick when I first got it it seemed really easy to take in and out um, but I don't know if it may be loosened or something um, but it made it more difficult to take out and there have been a couple times where it's been really stuck and I've had a lot of issues trying to get it out um, when I'm either putting the kayak in or I am taking it back out. Uh, the only other adjustment that I've had to make to this is I actually used a Dremel tool and I had to actually like waller out. I know waller, that's Kentucky language right there. Uh, I had to waller this out a little bit to get the pin to fit. Um, I'm sure that they have some, you know, R&D fit kind of stuff uh, going on when they were trying to rush these out because I got like one of the first ones that they came out with So I'm gonna show you guys what I did or what I'm gonna do to fix this and we will see how it works together All right, so I know this looks weird, but this is actually melted wax From my I have a you know one of those like your wife or you know significant other might have one It's one of those smelly good wax things um, a Wax melter type thing so what I'm gonna do is put a little of this wax on there um, and see if that doesn't help with a little bit of friction. Side effect is it smells extremely fresh. You know, kind of get some aromatherapy while you're on the water. But I'm hoping that, you know, and the good thing about wax is it repels water. But I'm hoping with this, um, you know, I can probably put it on a couple times and see if that doesn't help the friction with getting this thing in and out. So let's try it out. That's smooth like butter. That is so much smoother. So guys, um, as you can see, that's way easier than it was in the intro of the video where I was like really having to wiggle it and get it out. So if you're looking for something, uh, maybe try this out if you have one of these. Uh, comment down below if you've had some issues with the native sidekick or the Boondocks groovy landing gear with it kind of sticking. Um, another common upgrade people do to this is upgrade the wheels on it to a different type of wheel. But hopefully this helps you guys out. And as always guys, I appreciate you guys watching my channel. Don't forget to get outside, do something awesome, and take somebody with you if you get a chance. And I'll see Y'all in the next one.